Hi ninjas, and welcome to another visual guide of Seki. Although this game is very merciful with giving you sculptures idols to replenish your healing gourd usages, many times you might struggle against the boss since you run out of healing and start to panic because you have to be extra careful not to die during the fight. So to ease up the task, I will show you where to find all the gourd seeds in the game and get the full gourd achievement. The first one is acquired from defeating the first mini boss in the Ashina outskirts General Naomori Kawarada. Although most likely everyone goes through him and defeats him, this is an optional boss and doesn't need to be fought against. You will find him next to the gatehouse where you receive the shuriken wheel next to the outskirts wall gate path idol. The second one you will find at the gatehouse behind the chained ogre in the Ashina outskirts. After you grapple up, go to the room in the left and it will be right in front of you. The third one is available from the Battlefield Memorial Moth Merchant, who is accessible after you beat Oniwak Yobu. Head up the stairs leading up to the keep, turn right, but instead of going inside to meet the Tengu, head past the door and turn left. The merchant will be up the stairs and the gourd seed costs 1000 sen. The fourth one you can access once you beat the Blazing Bull and are in the Ashina Castle region. From the main entrance of the castle door just behind General Kuranosuke Matsumoto, turn right and as you come to a dead end, turn right and drop down. You see a small alley with an NPC called Fujioka sitting at the back of the alley. Talk to him, agree to take out the samurai behind the wall. After killing them all, talk to him again and then travel to the dilapidated temple. He should be now sitting outside the temple on the left and he will sell you the gourd seed for 2000 sen. Note that if you defeat Genichiro at the castle, Fujioka will appear at the temple anyway, but killing the samurai will make him come there earlier and buying the gourd seed might be of assistance a lot earlier. The fifth one can be found within a chest at the Ashina Castle Antechamber, right before the Ashina Castle Antechamber idol, after you pass the Nightjar Ninjas in the middle roofs and grapple inside through the window. The sixth one you can get as you venture into the Sunken Valley, and as you go forward from the Undershrined Valley idol, and jump to the first ledge where there is a Sunken Valley gunman guarding, kill him, head through the cave, and grapple up. Now as you grapple onto the next ledge, climb onto the ledge on the left, go through the cave, grapple onto the next ledge and then climb up to the ledge on the left. There is a hut and within this hut is a gourd seed. The seventh one is when you enter the first building in the Senpo temple and come to a praying room where three monks pray in front of a mummified infested monk. In front of the infested monk is the gourd seed. The eighth one is found in the center of Mibu village as you pass through the houses and come to a graveyard with the great sakura tree and its petals scattered on the ground. At the root of the tree you find the gourd seed. And finally, the ninth and final one can be found in the Fountainhead Palace after you pass through the cave where the Great Carp resides. You get to the surface, grapple up to the bedchamber where the palace nobles are devouring the corpses, kill them and head towards to the door on the right where you will find a chest on the right side. Open it and obtain the last Gorzi. And with that, we will wrap up with the video. You have now gained the maximum capacity for the healing gourd and can take on any boss or challenge with greater confidence. I hope this video was of help, leave a like if it was, subscribe for more, and if you have any questions or comments, let me know in the comments below. Thanks for watching, stay vigilant, and I'll see you next time.